Hey there guys, today is our second day for the Days of Mischief and the event will go on for 3 weeks having 3 phases. First, let's head to the event area to collect all 6 event currencies. Now 4 will be around the area and 2 can be obtained after getting cursed by a cranky spirit which is here, this one, and getting caught by a giant crab. Now from here, we just had to go to the other side to collect three event currencies. And to complete all six, let's head over to this new area inside. Now I haven't seen that cutscene for a while. <laughs> okay, let's go to the hole over here. And our last two should be located near the giant crab or in the giant crab. Alright, so first is, we have to get seen by this giant crab, with this one. Now look at the crabs. <laughs> look at this. There's so many, they're up for revenge. And then for the event currencies, it's over there. Oh wait, let's go collect first the one from the giant crab, this one. Then, the last one is over there. And then once we got that one, we are gonna do dailies. Our dailies today are gonna be here in the Golden Wasteland. But first, let's do a hug a friend and I have Pomi here. Although it's bugged on my end, I'm not sure if it's gonna be for everyone. So here we just have to offer a hug. Thank you so much Pomi. Then now let's head to the realm to collect our seasonal candles and perform the rest of the dailies. Alright, now let's try to look for unburned or unmelted darkness. And this quest also is performable in other realms. And unfortunately on my end this one is already burnt so let's look for another spot. And if the darkness here are already burnt and you've already taken the lights, you can just go back and try to burn them. Uh, the quest should still work even though you've already taken the lights because the lights are just extras for our candle currencies. Now I can see a seasonal candle over here. And, and also there are tons of dark plants down here. For the first season of candle, then for the second one should be here below the platform. Oh, crabbies don't hit me. <laughs> okay, oh, let's take first this darkness before we get merged to a server, having the plants burnt already. <laughs> and then once we get this one, let's go ahead and collect 
the rest of the season of candles. And after we've taken the last season of Kendo over here, we are gonna go ahead inside to do the spirit quest. This should be easy, but be cautious with the creel that passes by the area or the um, spirit's memory. Because this can be tough, but it should not get you like in so much trouble. over here and we can already see the spirit the stealthy survivor glowing just be careful though from the creels i was gonna say from the crabs from the creel over here and once you are already in a safe thing nothing should uh nothing worse should happen or bad should happen now let's relive this one And once we are done, let's head over to the shipwreck, the area where the crab fields is located. Now it should be just on the other side here in the wasteland. Now we should enter on that one, on that little portal or doorway to go to the area. And you can also head to the other side, to, the, to my left, I mean to my right. And you should be able to be directed to the shipwreck to collect the red light and there's also another location where we can collect the red light and it's in forgotten arc but forgotten arc though is a little too far so it's better to get the red light in here over here and once we got the dailies here we are gonna head to the daily prairie to collect our daily treasure candles and the first one is here by the social area then the second one should be here in the middle or the center of the Delhi prairie the third treasure candle is just ahead in the prairie village and the last one should be inside the prairie temple as well And that's it guys, thank you so much for watching, I hope you find this video helpful, bye everyone, see you next time!